8th, July, it's National Ice Cream Month. And today happens to be National Ice Cream Day. So to celebrate, we are spotlighting a sweet, creamy, and cold recipe for everyone to enjoy right from their own homes. Here now with us is Kylie Skill. She's the owner and blogger at Kylie's Kitchen with a delicious dessert that you can make right in your own kitchen. Kylie, thanks for being with us. Yes, thanks for having me. And not only is it National Ice Cream Day and month, it's also National Blueberry Month, which makes this Blueberry Graham Delight uh, ice cream from Hudsonville just perfect to make a sweet treat with. Perfect, it all sounds delicious. So what are you gonna be making for us today? So I'm gonna be making some lemon blueberry ice cream bars no bake, this couldn't be easier. So I'm gonna start here with um, some lemon sandwich cookies that I crushed in a food processor. You need four, between 14 and 16 ounces, so that's about 20 to 24 cookies. And then I just poured in a half stick of melted butter. And we're just mixing this around here until all the crumbs get coated in the butter. And you need that so that it forms a crust when we press it into our baking dish here. So and this what, is- what kind of ice cream, Kylie, are you going to be using? Because you mentioned it's, it's obviously, blue, uh, you're focusing on blueberries, the lemon, those sound yeah. like they're going to go great together. I would guess vanilla would play well with this, but can you use any kind of ice cream? So you can adapt this with whatever flavors you want. Ultimately, we're going to put on a blueberry sauce. So whatever goes well with that, or if you wanted to leave off the blueberry sauce, you have this lemon cookie crust here. But since it's National Blueberry Month, uh, Hudsonville also has this limited edition Blueberry Graham Delight ice cream, which is a vanilla ice cream with blueberry swirls. You can kind of see as I dig in there, the swirls that start sounds to amazing. are in the core there. It is amazing. Oh, and you can and see some, some blueberries in there too. Yeah. Yeah. There's lots of blueberries once you get um, to the core there. And then we're just going to spread this out on top. Now I like to um, soften my ice cream for about a half hour in the refrigerator before I start to work with it. So we're just going to spread that on top until you have a nice even layer. Stick that in the freezer for about an hour for it to set up. And while that's happening, we're going to make a blueberry sauce. And this is also super easy. Anyone can do this. Use a pound of fresh or frozen blueberries. Blueberries, of course, are great and in season right now in Michigan, but if you want to make this any other time, you can use frozen. And I just did a pound of blueberries with um, two teaspoons of cornstarch to help thicken it up, uh, two teaspoons of lemon juice, and a little bit of sugar, depending on your sweetness preferences. And that gets simmered for five minutes until you'll start to see it thicken up. So you'll know when it's ready. And then once your ice cream bars have set up, you can just pull them out of the freezer and drizzle some of this blueberry sauce sauce on top and it is so tasty here. Now Kylie, where can people go to check out this recipe? I'm sure a lot of people are going to want to know where they can find yeah. it. So you can find it on my blog, kylieskitchenblog.com. And also if you're looking to find this limited edition Blueberry Graham Delight ice cream, you can go to the Hudsonville website, hudsonvilleicecream.com. And they have a scoop locator tool so you can just type in your zip code and find which stores near you are selling it. Sounds delicious and looks delicious as well. Kylie Scales, thank you so much for joining us, owner and blogger at Kylie's Kitchen. We appreciate your time thank you and for that looks me. delicious. Yeah.